हेलो एवरी वन आई होप ऑल यूर डूइंग वेरी गुड इन यूर लाइफ मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम ऑल द स्टूडेंट्स मैसेजिंग मी एवरी टाइम स प्लीज अपलोड द मॉडल क्वेश्चन पेपर स प्लीज अपलोड द इम्पॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन सर प्लीज अपलोड द इम्पॉर्टेंट चैप्टर वाइज क्वेश्चन पेपर और मॉडल क्वेश्चन पेपर न्यूमरिकल्स एंड एवरी थिंग आई थॉट अ लॉट वे हाउ टू कन्वे द इंफॉर्मेशन through youtube and uh, after so many days i have worked so many things and i try to figure it out here i am going to explain you in this video uh, it is quite impossible to cover every module like uh, five module if i the video will be very lengthy so to avoid that i will explain you only one module so that once you watch this video completely then it is very easy to understand the things which i tried to explain or whatever the materials which i provided in, in a description box you can directly go and download the description box g link will be provided uh, there are two categories i have provided one is for more important chapters model wise and another uh, link is there to download for numericals as well as question bank model wise okay so for example this is module number 1 there are four chapters we can see here first one is free oscillation second one is damped oscillation third one is forced oscillation last one is shock waves in this uh, four chapter let me tell you which are the most important chapters first one is damped oscillation and second one is forced oscillation you can check any question paper in fact you can check your unit test question paper there you will find at least one derivation which is related to the damped oscillation or forced oscillation sometimes both will be there in your question paper and the most of the time in vtu exam they will ask you to write down either damped oscillation or forced oscillation sometimes uh, both damped and forced oscillation will be given for at least minimum 10 marks will be given okay so it is little bit dif uh, difficult and very lengthy derivation so that's why they always give you the 10 marks for this derivation sometimes to twist or to make it difficult to write down the uh, or attempt the questions uh, they will ask you to write down the cases for 10 marks for example discuss three cases in over damping critical damping and under damping in the damped oscillation instead of asking the damping equation sometimes they may ask you to discuss the three cases in forced oscillation instead of derivation so don't forget to read these two concept from damped oscillation and these two concept from forced oscillation definitely you will get minimum 10 marks okay so like that uh, for example let's start from beginning free oscillation in the free oscillation uh, you here i have mentioned the what are they they are going to ask you definition characteristics example of shm so shm related to definition characteristics and example uh, maximum for 2 marks along with that derivation of a differential equation of motion of and motion for shm starting from the hooke's law this is also an important derivation sometimes he may ask you for 6 uh, to 8 marks questions definitely they will ask you from the free oscillation chapter other than that you can't expect more than 6 6 marks for example law of conservation of mass energy and momentum this is also maybe for 6 to 4 marks question and there is no numericals will be covered in this chapters that means there is no numerical will be uh, expecting from this chapter like that in the mechanical simple harmonic oscillator here we can get one more derivation part straight away to 10 8 to 10 marks okay wherever i mentioned important derivation important derivation important derivation let me tell you those topics will be getting or you can expect 8 to 10 marks in vtu semester exams okay like another chapter is there for example this is a shock waves 
and uh, construction and working of a reti shockwave tube this is also a very important topics definitely he will ask you to 8 to 10 marks okay so from the module number one either damped oscillation or forced oscillation one derivation is will be fixed along with that shock waves and in these two chapters like free oscillation and mechanical simple harmonic oscillator so if he want to set a question paper pattern uh, you will get on this model 40 marks will be there and these 40 marks will be divided into 20 plus 20 so you have to write only for 20 marks for example uh, if i try to show it here in this we can explain we can see here there are two question paper on mod a uh, question paper model will be provided model number one okay two year question paper is there i just uh, cut the model number one part and uh, similarly i have prepared other chapters or other module also so let me explain you for first module number uh, first module how they frame the question as i said damped oscillation for 10 marks forced oscillation for 10 marks as i said these two derivation will be important in the model number one here as we can see here damped oscillation and forced oscillation previously as i said either damped oscillation or forced oscillation you will get definitely you will get the questions related to on that chapter and sometimes he may ask you to write down or discuss the cases of under damping as i said for 10 marks or sometimes he may ask you to derive the equation for damped oscillation similarly uh, discuss the theory of vib forced vibration and hence obtain the expression for amplitude here he asked for derivation sometimes he may ask you to write down the cases on forced oscillation for 10 marks so don't forget to read out that damped oscillation and forced oscillation similarly from the shock wave chapter you can expect mention the characteristics of shock waves here he uh, here he asked for six marks similarly the simple harmonic uh, motion derive the equation of simple harmonic motion using six, uh, hooke's law here he asked for six marks the mach number definition in the shock waves um, wherever numericals will be given for example in the mechanical simple harmonic oscillator here i mentioned numerical problems on time period frequency and spring constant will be given along with that numerical problems on natural frequency and uh, damped oscillation in the damp oscillation numerical problems on damping and quality factor in the forced oscillation uh, numerical problems on forced oscillation along with that in the case of shock wave you can expect numerical problems on mach number only so for problems definitely for four marks or less than four marks not more than four marks okay so uh, in the description box i have provided numericals also you can try that and uh, for example let's see another question paper here as i said hooks law will come for seven marks here and uh, need diagram of reti shock wave tube construction and working of net reti shock wave tube 10 marks and along with this here they he didn't ask you about forced oscillation damped oscillation in this part but here he asked for damped oscillation and derive the expression for dk amplitude hence they discuss the cases cases of critical damping once again he uh, he asked for damped oscillation like that you need to understand the question paper pattern and with respect to chapter wise importance uh, just giving you model question paper is not enough or just providing you numericals is not important just providing you question bank is not important in this uh, description box okay so as i said uh, you can you can't expect more than four marks in the problems and that too he will ask you uh, first or second type of uh, problems means 
first type means directly he will give the uh, some values and you need to remember the formula and uh, by substituting in that formula you need to extract the answer that is the first category kind of problems and another category problems is that he used to give some values which is not in a SI unit like he used to give you in uh, kilometer or meter or centimeter you need to convert it into meter or you need to convert that kilometer into meter uh, centimeter into meter or seconds into minute or minute into seconds and then substitute in the formula and then you need to uh, calculate the answer like that he will give you don't expect most more complicated questions from the problems section okay like this i have uh, provided all the details in the description box so for this i have spent most of the time to prepare it uh, and i felt i deserve a like button on this video and along with that i request you to share with uh, share this video with your friends so that they will get some help from this video as well as some material which i have provided in the description box okay it is little bit difficult to explain each module in single video because it will be very lengthy if i try to explain also so that's why i have just one module example in this video so that you will figure it out how the things will work with other chapters so go through the material download it and share with your friends so that they will also get help that material and it is uh, helpful for them to score very well okay with this let's wrap up the video and i would i would like to request you to subscribe to my channel share with your friends and all the very best for your upcoming semester examination with this let's wrap up the video thank you